Alrighty, Wednesday forecast time on the 28th of July, which just continues to push for the record books as uh, the wettest July on record. I don't know if we're going to get to number one. Slifer was talking about last week. I think we're a ways away from that, but we got a shot at number two. Yeah, yeah I've been going, be through, bad. going through the numbers right now and delving into them. Yeah, we're going to come up short on the records, but we're definitely in the top five, probably finish at number three or number two wettest July's on record. Kind of damp out there right now. Some of the lights over the city glistening. That's because there's some very light showers still falling. Fronts though offshore now and we're going to get improvements after some downpours came through last night. We'll start out in southern Maine. Still some steadier light rain for York County and some scattered sprinkles on up through Portland and some of the towns to the west uh, out through Westbrook and Gorham and up to Buxton too. As we go east, still seeing some heavier showers exit the Washington County coastline, but they're almost gone. Cutler, you've got them, and then they're over into the bays and out of here. Temps this morning right around 60, some lower 60s across the south. Notice it's cooler up in the mountains and north where it's already starting to clear out. It's also a lot drier here. Look at these dews. They're in the 40s. Compare that to southern Maine where it's still kind of sticky out there, low 60s, but it is about to get better. Front again off the coastline. The humidity is being swept out. Drier air is working in along with high pressure, so we'll develop sun this morning. It should be a beautiful afternoon and almost all of tomorrow looks really good too before the next weather system works in with some more heavy rain to finish out July. Clouds lingering, final drops are falling, and then we'll get into some clearing this morning and the humidity kind of diffuses in places that it's still rather high. Sunshine dominates for the middle of the day, comfortable temps and levels of humidity and this afternoon looks great. It will be mostly sunny. We won't have any interruptions from rain like we did yesterday afternoon and the wind will be light all day long and it'll actually turn on shore a little bit late in the day, giving a little sea breeze to the coastline. Here's a look at the highs today. Normally 80. We're actually going to come up a little bit short of that. We'll be up around 75 in Bangor, Augusta, Lewiston, close to that in Portland as well. Sanford and Portsmouth too. Mountains are a little cooler, low 70s here, near 70 in Aroostook County, no 80s on the map, and I don't expect to see them anytime soon. Tomorrow looks pretty good as this weather system works in from the west. The clouds will increase, but rain holds off until around dark tomorrow, or at least into the evening hours. Most of the day is a rain free one, but we will get into some heavy rain Thursday night through Friday morning. Then this low slides on out of here. Drier air works in behind it along with high pressure. We're going to have a breezy start the weekend, but it is going to be beautiful. The timing looks great for our weekend. Dry and pleasant with temperatures in the 70s, both Saturday and Sunday. A good looking weekend for a change. Marine forecast sees one to three feet. North winds lights becoming southeasterly in the afternoon. Water's up to 64 now after that warm day. Increasing sunshine, highs in the mid 70s. Tomorrow looks like increasing clouds. We'll get some rain at night. It could be on the heavy side. Highs again in the mid 70s. Friday showers around in the morning. It'll try to clear a little bit in the afternoon. In some places we will get brighter, but it's not going to be that sunny Friday afternoon. Highs 70 to 75. Saturday looks great. Mostly sunny, a little breezy. Highs in the mid 70s. Partly sunny on Sunday in the mid 70s. And then our next chance for rain will be early next week on Monday. No 80s. It's kind of incredible. End of July, early August, and we get seven straight days without any serious heat, Lee. Yeah, it's, uh, we talked about this yesterday. It looks like early September and we're still in late July. So. It does. Doesn't mean anything. No, it means good. We're, I mean, we're not I'm, done yet. I like that kind of weather. I mean, I'll take I 70s all day. a lot of people day. like that weather too. Wait, it's Maine Diego. <laughs> all 70s all the time. That's right. All right, thank you, sir. <laughs>